I'm gonna get banned at Evo. Like, look at this. Do you think this is okay? Do you think someone walking up to you with 10 bananas and then just doing this on you is okay? Like, I don't think it's okay. <laughs> I'm gonna get banned. <laughs> hey everybody, I'm Lewis. Today, I build a banana controller to play Street Fighter V with. And you're probably wondering why. For starters, look at Ken's hair. Like, how can I not think of bananas when I look at this ugly character? And honestly, the number one reason why I build the banana controller is because of this little thing right here. The hitbox. And if you're on FGC Twitter, you know that this box of buttons gave us content for weeks. And when I first saw the hitbox, I realized it was just a glorified banana controller. And I'm not even kidding, the banana controller has shortcuts just like the hitbox all the way down to even how it does DP inputs. It is actually easier to do DPs with bananas than it is with an arcade stick. You know, that's not a sentence I thought I would ever have to say. Before I go way too deep into the mechanics of the controller, we should first talk about the build. The banana controller has a layout of a simple arcade stick. Icky, but okay. Punch, kick, medium kick, medium punch, heavy punch, and that. And the best thing about all this, I think we could do some combos. A, okay. Right, this is my favorite part. Hold on. <laughs> this is a hitbox. This is just a really, this setup is just a really, really cheap hitbox. Okay, y'all know any Ken combos? I don't know. I don't play Ken. I refuse to play this character on principle. So, jump. I'm bad. <laughs> Wait, we can just even- we can just focus on the punches, right? <laughs> oh, no! Just like a hitbox, you can shortcut motion inputs by just holding and tapping the correct bananas. I was able to channel every Wi-Fi Ken I've ever played into doing DPs with these bananas. You know, I'll do it again. <laughs> I'll do it again. I'll do it three times. What if I do it four times? <laughs> One more for the boys back home? I'm sorry. Now that the banana controller is built, it was time to take it online and see how viable it is. As a wise man once said, what's the worst that can happen? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I lost. The first thing I need to learn with this potassium controller is how to block correctly. You would think this would be a no-brainer, but I had the same issues when I started learning how to use hitboxes. It feels like I'm learning how to play fighting games all over again, and honestly, it's kinda cool. And ooh, y'all, don't get me started about blocking cross-ups. My hand to banana coordination is not there yet, and ooh, it's so rough. And what makes it worse is that the bananas were so big, I had to use both hands to move and block, so blocking lows was such a nightmare. And on the topic of lows, I think I found the ultimate day one banana controller strategy. Jump attack and then sweep. Now that I got the Krabby Patty winning secret formula, it's time for our second match. Let's see if I can pull off a win this time. Things? One of them is remembering what banana does what. A Ryu! Only swept? Oh, nice. Good sweep. Got a block on wake up, homie. <laughs> okay, okay, we're learning, we're learning. <laughs> you know, that's my fault. I'll do it again. I'll do it again. <laughs> oh, I'm not blocking. Ooh. <laughs> yes! We took her out! <laughs> oh shoot! They're learning? Oh, I'm doing it. Okay, I'm doing it again. I'm doing it until I get this right. <laughs> I was gonna say, I'm learning. Ow! I'm still heading to the core of my blocks! Okay, okay, we walk it. It's okay. Oh no, it's not okay! I'll play Sweet Wars with you all day, dude. Oh my god. Like, oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, I forgot which button, which banana was blocked, y'all. I should have medium punched DP there. Oh. <laughs> Yes! Okay, we got something. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, we're, we're learning. We're learning. It's so hard to block clocks ups on a freaking banana. We won! I thought we had another round! Let's go! <laughs> okay, 
Okay, okay. Okay, we got a, we got a good jump in. Oh no, I swap sides. Oh, no, my sweep. Oh, nice. <laughs> Did he press the button? Oh no, we won. We take it. We take it. You this win. is such a gross setup. Oh my gosh. Hey, I can finally say I won a match with Street Fighter V using just bananas. But before we do another match, I had to find out if my banana controller was even legal for EVO. We can actually go through all the rules together and see if the banana controller even holds up to any of them. Rule number one and two, the controller can't activate multiple inputs from a single button input. We're pretty safe on this rule as one banana equals one input. Rule number three, the controller may not send simultaneous opposite cardinal directions game inputs. Even though it took me a lot of takes to say that line, the banana Banana controller lives again as it's just emulating an Xbox controller which we all know is allowed at tournaments. Now the next really is definitely going to put the banana controller into a split. And I'm really sad to say this but the banana controller is illegal to use at EVO because it does use a Titan 2, which is completely against EVO's rules for input converters. But there is a future out there where I bring my banana controller to EVO and I actually get kicked out because technically it's illegal. But whatever the ruling is, it won't stop me from taking the banana controller online and seeing if I can win a match or two. That bat. You can cross it to the corner. I keep forgetting. Stop pressing button. Stop. Stop. <laughs> I did it. I'm so bad. <laughs> well, that's a little annoying. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> it goes over loaves. I'm scared. This is someone who doesn't have anything to lose. This is someone who has nothing to lose. They don't care about my livelihood. They don't care about my children. They don't care about my lineage. They're trying to kill me. Too late. Oh, good grab. I'll do it again, though. <laughs> I was gonna say. I'm okay. <laughs> uh, DP? There he goes. <laughs> Let's try to teabag. It's just to hit DP, you have to punch this poor bruised banana twice and then do it. they really not rematch on a banana? There's no way in our good year of 2022 that people don't rematch in casuals. Even though I want to celebrate this victory, it came at a very high price. Our banana controllers bruised the hell up and it started to leak everywhere, which means it's time to stop. And sorry if you had to learn it from me, but yes, bananas do leak and it's kind of gross. On the bright side, this $30 hitbox did its best and honestly, that's all I could ask for. Also, if you're watching this video and you have second thoughts about playing fighting games because they seem too hard, just remember this. If someone can win games with a hand of bananas, you can win a game too. If y'all have any suggestions on what weird controller I should play fighting games with, just leave a comment below. Until the next video, y'all, Stay safe and subscribe for more.